tutorial on how to measure distance and how to measure direction in Google Earth. I'm going to firstly show you how to measure uh, direction. Uh, actually, I'm going to show you how to use measure distance first. Click on this little icon up here in Google Earth. This is the ruler. Click on the ruler. It shows you uh, the ruler, uh, the measurement guide. Here is the map length. That's the distance. The ground length is also distance. They're usually very similar. And the, and the heading is the direction. So this is the map length is distance, heading is direction. And I'm going to measure between these two points here in Hong Kong. I'm going to click on CIS. I'm going to measure all the way down to this untitled place mark, which is IFC. And I'm going to click on that. It's going to tell me that it's 3.95 kilometers. The ground length is 3.96. And I'm hitting 271.89 degrees. Now, now the way we we met, I think the the distance or the length is relatively straightforward, but the direction, just to explain that, due north, which is this direction, I'm sort of heading up over here. In fact, I'm going to move this over. You can see here, this tells you where north is. It's heading that way. That is zero degrees. So if you're heading in a northerly direction, you're going in zero degrees. If you're heading east, which is out this way, you're going to be heading 90 degrees. South, you head 180 degrees and west you're going to be hitting 270 degrees. That's, that's basically how we measure direction uh, when we're uh, doing geogra in geographic terms. So in this case I'm going just past 270 degrees, it's 271.89 degrees and of course there's 360 degrees in that circle there. So uh, that's how you measure distance, that's how you measure direction using Google Earth and thank you for watching the tutorial.